Hey there, today we're having a look at this Cotopaxi barrel bag. Bit of a pan around. As you can see, it's pretty standard looking luggage. And that's exactly what it is. What's so good about this pretty standard luggage? You get a very capable bag. This isn't a bushcraft bag, this isn't a survival bag. This isn't even a camping or hiking bag, really. It is purely a good portage option for your clothing. So, in my opinion, it's probably a great beach bag. Or you know what? It's a great travel bag of any sort. What do you get? You get 35 litres of rather square um, single pocket. Actually, it's got two pockets, but one main single compartment. Two carriage methods. Handle there. Or the uh, two sturdy handles there. Let's uh, go handy cam and uh, have another closer look. So inside this bag, uh, 35 litres is a fair bit of space. It's about the size of most day packs, it's just it's on its side and you're obviously not a backpack. However, if you're keen, you could put in arm through this and this and wear it as somewhat of a backpack if you thought that was necessary. So let's have a look. This uh, is obviously the main compartment here. Two zippers, hold one, pull the other one. Inside I've got large man's hat, change of shirt, change of shorts, change of jocks, and two full-size adult towels. There we are. So you can see inside it's quite just a pretty standard cavernous opening bag. There is a side pocket, like so. This is why I would make a good beach bag because you've got a separate storage area for some essential reading. Nintendo DS with uh, Super Smash Brothers, very good option there. And of course, a Leatherman Surge. So um, you sort of fit all your, all your essentials in the bag as well. Overall, this will cost you 25 US dollars and it has all the same Good things about it that all Cotopaxi products do. It's made of strong ripstop nylon material, sort of a very nice, um, sort of semi waterproof, so it's got this rubberized um, interior, and on the outside it's just got that sort of extra crosshatch um, little pattern there. It just feels very strong. The handles certainly aren't going anywhere because they're attached like so. Very heavy duty stitching all the way around the uh, underside of the bag, so very very strong. And although they are obviously backpack straps, in a pinch you can wear it as such if you just wanted to have both hands free while you were still travelling. So, stand up there. Yeah. Not too bad at all, in my humble opinion. $25, you really can't go wrong. Thanks for watching, dudes.